Antonio Spurs. Six seven. Starting at four. Number thirty. Julian Champagne. Six eight. Starting at four. Number ten. Jeremy Sobey. Number 33, Trey Jones. 6'5", number 24, Devin Bussin. 6'7", Hello from 2K Sports. We're honoring diversity and culture tonight with the NBA celebration of Noche Latina. Alongside Grant Hill and Brent Berry, I'm Brian Anderson. Also with us tonight, our reporter, Ali LaForce. And here's a look at some numbers for Stephen Curry. And he's taken a small step back offensively. He really hasn't been the same this month as he was earlier on. He's lacking the intensity he had. He needs a new mindset and stop being passive and play with more aggressiveness. All right, checking out Golden State's opening lineup. Thompson and Wiggins on the wing. Green out there with Kaminga. And it's Curry in at the point. And for San Antonio, Jones and Vassell are the one and the two. Inside at the four and five, it's Sohan and Wimbanyama. And it's Champagne at the small forward. Most NBA fans are looking ahead to the playoffs. But what's on the mind of the players at this point of the season, Grant? Well, B.A., focusing just on the postseason is a big mistake. Players know you have to be focused on the task at hand. You have to stay in the moment. Only think about that game right in front of you. And it's going to be the Spurs off the tip. Jones against Curry. And there's the call. It's going to be an illegal screen. The screener was leaning a bit right there. His feet may not have been planted. Pretty obvious call by the officials. Got to hold firm or you're going to get a call. Pass to Green. Outside Kaminga. Jones against Curry. Thompson outside. Shoots over Vassell. And it's Thompson that time on the assist from Curry. Yeah, it feels like Steph doesn't even have to look. He just knows where his teammates are. Jones, the pass to Wembanyama. And he buries his first look. Well, if you're giving up that much height, the only thing that you can do as a defender is to foul him. And so Thompson will bring it up for the Warriors. Pass to Curry. Puts up a deep three. That one no good. On offense, here is San Antonio. Now Jones. Inside, here's Wimbanyama. Rebounded by Green. Now here's Thompson. And here is Green. And here's Curry. Three-pointer. Sends it home from three-point land. I mean, just so easy for Curry to get that three off. Beautiful shot. Pass to Wimbanyama. Oh, Green with a block. Wimbanyama. First personal foul. First team foul. Shooting for Golden State. Stephen Curry at the line for one. Well, you look at Draymond's NBA career, such a staple of this Warriors team's run of success. Well, maybe in the way that he plays it gets overshadowed because people don't recognize the true greatness and what he does defensively. But Draymond talks enough for you to recognize just how much he means to this team and the way they've won championships around his demeanor. Now here's Curry. 
a reliable go-to guy for them. He's averaging around 26 and a half a game. Play not forcing anything, just waiting for his time and collecting points in the flow of the offense. Jones against Curry. Pass to Champigny. Now here's Wimbanyama. He's closely guarded. Jones with the ball. He's covered by Curry. Just five on the clock. San Antonio again missing. Maybe a little false confidence there. Not a high percentage shot for him. Coaches will tell you that's a bad shot, but when your teammates tell you that, probably got to think about it. Now here's Green. In his last outing, eight points for him. That's yeah, pretty much the only way to keep him from taking advantage of you down low. You've got to play tough, physical defense. Pass to Champigny. Stolen by Wiggins. It's hauled in by Wimbanyama. Practically a block. <laughs> Good, strong challenge. Yeah, altering the shot just as long as there's a miss. That kind of energy not wasted. And it's good to see Vassell find the open man as he continues to evolve as a playmaker. Now Curry. Wiggins, right side. Rebounded by the Spurs. This game coming on the heels of their win versus the Knicks. And at the offensive end, they were lights out in that game. They found all sorts of ways to punish the deep. Yeah, I love watching that game and, in particular, their demeanor in their destruction in that game. Wimbanyama, screen on Kaminga. On target from range. And keeping everyone involved early. Now, that typically pays dividends. Yeah, and he's so-so from there, but when he's hitting from deep, it's a big confidence builder. Now here's Curry. A 23-point game for him in the win against Charlotte. Kuminga, the pass to Wiggins. Six on the shot clock. Thompson, money from the wing. Thompson. Thompson's got seven points in the game. And Wiggins is a capable passer, someone that wants to hit a guy in the right spot. Jones in the post. He's covered by Curry. Well, there's no question that the Warriors are the team of the decade, Grant. Oh, I mean, B.A., think about it. Six finals appearances in eight years. They didn't miss the playoffs in two of those seasons, but they still came away with four championship rings plus two MVP trophies. Not bad. Shooting two. That's good from Jones. Jones hits them both. Two-part equation. You have to be aggressive enough to get to the line than talented enough to sink him. Curry against Jones. Curry drives in. Blocking foul called on Jerry Sohan. First personal foul. Second team foul. Pass to Green. Jacks up a three, connects again from distance. And night in and night out, you can count on him to really stretch the defense. Would you believe he's now tied for fifth most triples in a single season? You're pulling even with Steph Curry, who in 2017 also hit 324 threes. Now, we'll see where it goes from here, but it should be fun to track. Golden State has gone three of four on threes here in this first quarter. passes to Thompson. Green with the ball. Now guarded by Wimbanyama. Clock at six. Up top, Wiggins. And the Warriors with another three! Well, if Wiggins hits these three-point balls at a high clip, he'll become a much better player and more dangerous for this offense. Jones. 
Jones, the pass to Wambanyama. Pass to Vassell. Banked it in off the glass. Pounding it inside early and often, setting a physical tone. And here's Thompson. He'll bring it up for Golden State. Four-point game. Coming off a win against the Hornets. And guys, those road games are never easy. But they had a solid strategy going in and stuck to what they do best. Yeah, watching that game quarter to quarter, they sped up, they slowed down, but they executed in every facet. Three-pointer, no good. San Antonio's gone one or two from three-point land so far. To the middle. Here's Champagny. The rebound by Wiggins. Bad offense against bad defense. The play looked as ugly as you'd imagine. Here's Champagny. He's covered by Curry. Champagny, the pass to Jones. Here's Sohan. Wimbanyama screen. Fires from deep. And again, it's San Antonio with a three. Both teams are hot. Woo! This is a fun one to watch. Yeah, made for TV game here. Pace is great. Scoring is coming in bunches. And both of the teams feeling confident right now. Now here's Wiggins. A 20-point game for him and the win against Charlotte. Lest us not forget about the work on the glass. His effort level was a 10 that night out of 10. Here's Thompson. Good! Another from three. Another three to add to his tally. He continues to prove he's one of the greatest shooters ever. That triple just tied him for fifth place on the career list. Yep, he's up to 2,450, even with Kyle Korver. But he still's got a lot of work to do to overtake Steph in first. Now here's Wiggins. And here's Curry for three. It's hauled in by Wimbanyama. Wimbanyama's got five rebounds in the game. Jones, the pass to Vassell. Pass to Wimbanyama. And he converts the layup. Wimbanyama's got six. Yeah, the control from Wimby. I mean, this guy is unreal. Jones against Curry. Thompson outside. Off the mark there with a three. The Spurs have got seven of 11 shots to find the mark. Jones drives in. The shot is good, and this game is back to even. Six points for him. Looks like we're starting to see a pattern here. Not afraid to get in the paint and get wet. Curry passes to Wiggins. Here he goes, and it's in there. And the Warriors lead by two. Yeah, I think there were some toughness questions around Andrew Wiggins. Not anymore. This guy has become a pretty gritty player. Pass to Sohan. Jones against Curry. And the foul called on Draymond Green. That's his first foul of the game. And the Spurs with some changes. Collins, he's checked in for Wimbanyama. Keldon Johnson comes in for Champagny. And it's Wesley in for Jones. Wesley, the pass to Sohan. Collins with a screen on Green. Here's Sohan. He drops it from range. The Warriors have got 8 of 15 shots to go. Paul with it. 11 points for him last game against Charlotte. Yeah, but there's always this point you got to look at. Where did he also impact the game? It was on the rebounding end of the floor. A tremendous performance there. Now here's Vassell. Pass to Wesley. Here's Sohan. Green covering. Five to shoot. Here's Wesley. Oh, from deep. Looney grabs a miss. Vassell against Thompson. Shoots over Vassell. Thompson's shot is off. I love how they've attacked the boards here in the first quarter. Pass to Wesley. Johnson on the wing. Two minutes remaining in the first. 
Vassell outside from deep. It's rebounded by Golden State. You know, they beat the Spurs during their last encounter in San Antonio. They were allowed to ramp up their offense as the defense they faced was barely present. Yeah, with the defense struggling like that, I think they just stayed with a healthy, consistent pace to get that win. He's got a knack for finishing inside. That's easy money. Vassell outside. Johnson against Thompson. Collins with a screen on Thompson. Kicks it out to Collins. Takes a three. Looney grabs a miss. The Warriors leading. You know, Brent, we always hear Looney's teammates talk about his value to the team. How about the dirty work that he does on a nightly basis? Rebound, setting screens, setting guys up with some pretty good passing because he's so familiar with the offense. This guy is in a perfect role with this squad. First free throw is good. I mean, so much glue in this guy as Draymond focuses on making all the winning plays that he possibly can. A different look for San Antonio. Wimbanyama's checked in for Sohan, and Branham subbed in for Vassell. The Warriors also with a sub. Curry's checked in. And that's good as he hits both shots. There's a minute 12 left in the first quarter. Outside Johnson. Here's Collins. Yet to see a basket. Outside Johnson. Good. And the assist to Wimbanyama. Wimbanyama's got three assists now in this one. What a smart pass from Wimbanyama. Already adept at scanning the floor and finding open teammates. Now here's Green. He's averaging just around eight and a half points a game. Green, a screen. And Paul gets it to go. And the Warriors lead by two. Now the future Hall of Famer, Chris Paul, at it again. Here's Wesley. He's guarded by Paul. Wimbanyama, screen on Paul. Here's Wesley. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. Green's got his fourth rebound in this one. And so far, they've had the advantage on the board. Pass to Pajemski. And it's blocked by Collins. Terrific instincts defensively as Zach Collins able to reach over and get that one. And oh, it goes! Baby. They got that he one. Gets it. Wow. That's before the buzzer right there. Whoa! The heat to beat the buzzer. That's an incredible shot there. Just let it fly, take a chance, and somehow that one goes in. One quarter in the books, and it's been a close one. And the second quarter about to get started. We'll be back in a moment. game underway so far. We'll see if either of these teams can jump out ahead in the second quarter. Let's get a quick check of the scoring breakdown here for San Antonio. Ever since this game started, they've been attacking on the inside, looking for ways to bust up the defense and get high percentage looks. Well, not only that, but you love how unselfish they've been to start this game. That's going to get all the guys in a great flow and feeling good. So moving that ball around and scoring off assists is a nice way to play. On the floor for the Warriors. Small lineup with Paul and Curry pairing up in the backcourt. Dario Saric is out there with Kevon Looney. And it's Pajemski in at the three, the small forward. Here's Branham. He's coming off a 10-point game against New York. Here's Wesley. He's guarded by Paul. 
Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. All right, Grant, I'm going to ask you to put on your executive hat now. Tell us what the key is to establishing culture at an NBA organization. NBA, culture, structured accountability. It's about getting the right group of guys, having strong leadership. And, of course, it only works if the coaches and players fully buy in. Free throw is good from Collins. Zach Collins is aggressive and confident and waiting for his opportunity to show just how consistently good he can be in the NBA. And both free throws good for Collins. A big fellow with the ability and confidence at the free throw line is something that every team wants. Don't have to make those late substitutions. Keep your big guys on the floor. Now here's Paul. Rebounded by the Spurs. Wimben Yama's got six rebounds here tonight. Johnson passes to Branham. Wimben Yama, screen on Curry. Pass to Wimben Yama. Here's Wesley. He's guarded by Paul. Six to shoot. From deep, Wimben Yama. Hauled in by Paul. And it's Paul with the ball for Golden State. They trail by three. Takes a 13-footer. Chalk up two there. Paul's gotten his second bucket of the game. When the defense gives you room, take it. Don't pass up the shot. Wesley, the pass to Johnson. Here's Wimanyama. And that's his fourth bucket of the game in seven attempts. Oh, man, this would be a different ball game if they didn't have this type of scoring to rely on. Curry surveys. From outside the arc. And again for three. And now claiming the mark for hitting the fifth most threes in a season. Wow. <laughs> a tremendous feat. It's incredible how he can control the game from the perimeter. Just like the only other player in this category's top five, Steph Curry. What an honor to be mentioned alongside with him. Wesley, that's good. They're punishing those late defensive rotations, getting good looks inside throughout the half. Outside Curry. Pass to Pajemski. On the wing, Curry. Rebounded by the Spurs. Couldn't quite line that one up. Just got to shake it off and move on to the next one. Here's Wesley. He's guarded by Paul. Looney against Wimbanyama. Here's Wesley. Oh, he tries a three. It's hauled in by Sharich. Outside Paul. Shara to screen. Fires for three. Curry's shot is off. It hasn't been his best quarter. I mean, he's trying to shoot himself out of the slump. Wesley, the pass to Branham. To the left side wing. Wimanyama misses the jumper from the wing. Probably not the shot that was drawn up for that possession, but you can't pass it up and you can't knock it down. Pass to Pajemski. Takes the three. Gets the three ball to go. Pajemski's got his first three points of the game. And CP3 with that court awareness, it's legendary, exceptional at realizing when his guys are wide open. Now here's Johnson. Defense right on him. From 15 feet away, and he knocks the jumper down. Johnson's got five now. Yeah, not the easiest shot. Johnson not afraid of a challenge. Here's Pajemski, covered by Johnson. Here's a three from Paul. And the Warriors with another three. Well, plenty of give and take so far. Yeah, six lead changes already. Both teams came to play. To the inside. And he goes in for the dunk. And nobody putting out much of an effort to stop him. Surprising in a close game, a lack of energy on defense. On one side, inspiration. On the other, 
devastation. Here's Paul. The Spurs making their last shot. Oh, Curry, just nasty from downtown. A dozen consecutive points off of threes. This defense looks rattled. Wesley, the pass to Johnson. And there's the whistle. The illegal screen is the call. Now a moment to take a look at the year-to-year -year scoring output and how it's been trending for Andrew Wiggins. And when you look at his offensive output over the past few years, it seems like other teams have figured him out and have his number now. He's having to put in a lot more effort on the offensive end, but without producing nearly the same results. Golden State has gone four of six from outside. Looking sharp here in the second. Outside, green. Wiggins with it, and Johnson picks him up defensively. Wiggins passes to Curry. Oh, he got hacked on the three-pointer, and he'll head to the line. It's going to be on Victor Wimanyama. Curry excellent at reading the defense and taking advantage of any mistake. All right, guys, let's get your take on the scoring breakdown for the Warriors. They've done a great job facilitating shooters. Their early game has seen a lot of hot passes and has kept the defense guessing as well. It feels like the three-point line has opened up really early in this one, too. They've been looking confident from behind the arc, but there's a lot of attempts going up. And that one falls for Curry. You talk about players that mean so much to their team. Stephen Curry at the top of that list, Brent. Yeah, you just look at the numbers, B.A. They're staggering about what happens when this team doesn't have Steph Curry on the floor. And really, Curry becomes the entirety of the way this offense works. Collins, he's checked in for San Antonio. Vassell comes in for Johnson. Good on the second one. Tell me the last time you watched Steph Curry on an NBA floor not have a smile on his face. I mean, always playing with that infectious joy. And he makes all three. Yeah, just knocking down every free throw. I mean, I love to see this kind of efficiency. Time called here. San Antonio decides to talk it over. Position. These are the players who have really been consistent from the charity strike this year. Stephen Curry, number one. His team must love how dependable he is from the charity strike. They can count on him on the floor and at the line, too. Here's Vassell. A 23-point game for him in the win against New York. Pass to Sohan. The cell against Curry. On the wing, Jones. He's coming off a 13-point game against New York. Out of bounds, it'll go to the Warriors. Curry will bring it up for Golden State. Six-point lead. Pass to Green. Up top, Paul. From deep. And that one's good. And Green with the assist. Paul's got eight here in this quarter. Wow, five consecutive threes. This defense looking very frustrated right now. Now here's Jones. He's got six. Vassell outside. Collins with a screen on Curry. Pass to Collins. And stolen by Green. Now here's Curry. And Curry with the take. They double team Curry. And here's Paul. Shot clock at six. Floats one. Curry. That's good. And now an 11 point Warrior lead. This quarter belongs to him. And that's how you do it when you're out in front. Don't play it safe. Keep that momentum going. Time called here. The Spurs decide to talk it over. 
And the players take this opportunity to get some Gatorade. Getting some fluids in you is so important during these timeouts. Get fresh, keep those batteries charged. Yeah, without proper hydration, a player can completely run out of gas down the stretch of a ball game. And that's something that none of these guys can afford to have happen. If you're going to battle all the way to the finish, you have to be hydrated. And the Warriors making a change here. Thompson's checked in. Jones with the ball. Green picks him up. The floater. And it goes out of bounds. That one off Green. San Antonio ball. Can they get it? The Warriors have gone 7 for 11 in the second quarter. Thompson left side. Stolen by Jones. Count it. Jones has got eight. Here's Curry. He's got 18. Thompson outside. Connects again from distance. Yeah, he's one of the greatest from distance in NBA history. And with that three, he's now fifth on the all-time career list. Yeah, and this is the most modern of the major top five lists. All of the members played in the 2000s. So showing you how the game has evolved. Let's check in with our reporter, Allie LaForce. Well, Andrew Wiggins has come into his own in Golden State. He said, quote, I feel like I scored a lot in Minnesota and no one cares, but now I'm here. I'm playing winning basketball. I am working my tail off. I'm playing the best defense I can possibly play, and I'm still giving you 18, 19, 20 points. Brian? Allie, he has found a home. No question about that. Thank you. Now here's Curry. Thompson outside to the paint. Here's Kuminga. Rebound San Antonio. I'm not going to see that very often. The defense in the vicinity, but still, he's not one to blow layups. Collins right side. And that's a foul. Called on Stephen Curry. That's foul number two for him. This is one where the second foul is probably going to cost you some minutes in this game. Johnson, he's checked in for San Antonio. Number three, Keldon Jackson. Pass to Champagny. Here's Sohan. Green covering. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. Second. Heady play to stop that easy layup right there. I mean, make him earn it at the line. At the line for two. Sohan. And he drops the first. Chris Paul, he's checked in for Stephen Curry. Both good from the line that time. And they seem to have taken a more heads-on approach this quarter. And it's getting them to the free throw line. Pass to Green. Thompson with it. Wiggins outside. And that one goes in as he's fouled. It'll be three points if he converts the free throw. Second team foul. Shooting for Golden State, Andrew Wiggins. One shot. And the 
free throw, no good. And in deciding against lowering the minimum age for the NBA draft. Grant, you think it's fair to 17 and 18 year olds who want to go pro? You know, B.A., I do think it's fair. I mean, there are other avenues in today's basketball environment where compensation for these guys is possible. You have the overseas route. You have the G League Ignite. And of course, now colleges have the NIL. So that's huge. Now here's Wiggins. He's got seven. Drains the triple. And now a 12-point Warrior lead. Exactly what every offense needs. Shooters who can force the defense to extend. No, oh, there's no doubt he's a legitimate threat from downtown, and he's demonstrating that in this game. Here's Sohan. He's got 11. And there's a whistle. That goes on Devin Vassell. That's foul number two for him. I love great defense. Just quick to establish his feet and he takes the hit and the Warriors shooting has been great 57% and finding ways to score consistently Paul passes to Green now Thompson and it's off from three-point range pass to Jones outside Johnson Jones in the post. He's guarded by Paul. Here's Sohan. Thompson with a steal. And they're running. And Chris Paul, when he gets into those tight spots, he comes pretty smart in it. You know, when you talk about Chris Paul, you get the sense we are in the final years of his career, Brent. Yeah, that's definitely how it feels, but I love that CP3 is not going to let you know about it. He's going to continue to go out there and compete and do whatever it takes to contribute to winning. And he will continue to play at a high level. That free throw, no good. And one of the things through the years that you respect about Chris Paul is that competitive fire, that competitive edge he brings to every game. He really does care only about winning. Curry, he's checked in for Wiggins. And the second free throw is good. Here's Jones. Give him eight. Pass to Champigny. Over Thompson. Champigny, that's good. Champigny's got five points in the quarter. And they had early success from the perimeter, but I don't understand how they've gotten away from that here in the second. Green with a screen on Jones. Paul passes to Green. And it's blocked. And here's Vassell. Hovering around 19 and a half points a game. His scoring has been huge for them. And the three-pointer goes. Yeah, when it comes to his three-point shooting, Johnson is most effective from the corners. Now here's Paul. Curry. Look at Chef Curry. Cooking it up inside. Solid in the first fantastic here in the second he was just waiting for the moment all against Jones here's Sohan 11 points in the game Johnson with a bucket every year Johnson is a bigger scoring threat and the defense has to work just a little harder against him Paul taking his time here Outside Curry, launches the three. Yes, and it's Paul with the assist that time. Paul's got five assists in the game. Oh, five threes this half. The D can't contain this guy. Now here's Jones. Give him eight. And that's a foul called on Stephen Curry. That's his third foul so far. Yeah, looking up at the scoreboard, guys, that's his third foul, and his coach has to consider now sitting him down. Andrew Wiggins checked in for the Warriors. Andrew Wiggins. San Antonio with the ball. 11-point game. Johnson passes to Sohan. Here's Champagny. Kaminga pulls it in. I admire the play call. They just couldn't capitalize. Yeah, an efficient offensive possession. They found the look that they wanted, just didn't go in. Now here's Wiggins. He's got seven. Back to Paul. Wiggins finds Paul. Five on the clock. Blocked! 
phenomenal defense. The long arms of Vassell helping him come up with that block. And that shot was going nowhere thanks to that aggressive swap. You know, you can't ask for any better defense than that. He responded so fast to the shooter, and it stifled him. There's 18 seconds left in the half. Thompson, no good. Here's Champagny. He picked up 12 points in their last win against New York. Pass to Thompson. From deep three-point land. And that's not going to go. And this is Vassell's calling card. Suffocating defense. And so it's the Golden State Warriors. Closing out the quarter ahead by 11 points. Great shot selection right now. Keeping the game simple and getting high percentage looks. All right, now let's check in with Allie LaForce. Allie, what do you have? Thanks, I'm here with Coach Popovich. And Pop, I know you're not happy with the first half. They've taken the fight to you thus far. How do you take it back? Yeah, they've been the, the aggressive team. I think we played really soft so far. Really pathetic defensive performance. Coach, hopefully more toughness from your team in the second half. Thanks. Thanks very much, Allie. And folks, we'll be right back to start the second half of this game. Hey, everybody. Psst. I got a secret. We're approaching the playoffs, and we are starting the show with a breakdown of the Western Conference standings. When I look at San Antonio, they've wanted this to be a turnaround season. They have a few building blocks, but the roster construction is not complete. This front office has some tough decisions to make. And now let's take a look at our featured game. No surprise, Steph Curry was in fine form during that first half. Well, we've gotten used to performances like this from Curry. With his handles, his range, he can get any shot he wants, and off the ball, he consistently and constantly moves. Well, I wonder how many miles he runs in the night just running off picks. Probably like, I would say three to four miles just running off picks alone. Three more, just bringing it up. Probably a nine-mile night. That's it for us. Thanks for tuning in. Now let's send you over to Brian Anderson with the third period. And there wasn't too much drama in the first half, but maybe things will tighten up here in the second. Stephen Curry having a dominant impact in this game. Through two quarters of play, he's been an excellent source of points. Yeah, he's, he's shouldering the load right now and looking really comfortable while he's doing it. And here are the Warriors now. Inside at the four and five, it's Sohan and Wimbanyama. Jones and Vassell are the one and the two. And it's Champagne at the small forward position. That's who's in the game for the Spurs. Oh, and Clay makes that three look so easy. You just get the feeling that whenever Clay rises up, he's going to make it. Vassell outside. Here's Sohan. Wimbanyama up top. And he makes it. Wimbanyama's got 10 points in the game. Yeah, this is what everyone wants to see Wimbanyama doing. Dominating on the inside. Outside Curry. Here's the three. Yes. And it's Paul with the assist that time. And the Warriors lead by 15. Man, they're having a hard time defending the triple. That's three in a row. Jones, the pass to Wimbanyama. Inside, here's Champagny. Drops in the layup for two. Seven points in the game. For Vassell to really make an impact, that's what he has to do. Initiate the offense. Outside Paul, to the middle. Oh, Kaminga, just a menace inside. How about that? Coming out to start the half, a perfect three of three. Jones against Paul. 
Outside Jones. Shoots over Paul. Again, the Spurs score. Hey, they're just getting pushed around inside. The Warriors have gone three of three in the second half. Paul passes to Green. And here is Thompson. Outside Paul. 4-3. It's hauled in by Wimbanyama. Wimbanyama's got rebound number eight here already in the game. Jones, the pass to Sohan. Back to Jones. With some arc. It's rebounded by Golden State. Only their first miss in four attempts. It's been a great start to the half. Paul passes to Green. Green gets up and powers it down. For all the things that Draymond does, when he gets dunks, it makes him even more excitable. Wimbanyama, screen on Paul. Pass to Sohan. The three is up. Kept alive. He gets it in there. Wimbanyama's got four points in the quarter. Maybe he's thinking at this point, man, somebody's got to help me. I can't do this all by myself. Now a timeout called by Golden State. And the Warriors making a change here. Wiggins has checked in. Let's check in on the Western Conference standings as the race to the playoffs continues. You take a look at the Warriors. Right now, they're in 10th place, hoping to get themselves into the playoff picture. And, of course, San Antonio. Currently, they're five spots behind them. Clock keeps going. Three minutes into the second half now. Jones against Curry. He buries it from three. Curry's got 29 points. Their strategy has been pretty simple here in the second half. Attack from three-point range. Maybe trying to find a little bit more space and ball movement to get guys open at the three-point line. Now here's Vassell. Clock at six. Over Thompson. Nails the 16-footer. Vassell's gotten his second bucket. And Vassell can get that shot anytime he wants. Thompson against Vassell. Outside Curry. From deep three-point land. From beyond the arc and then some. Curry's got nine points now in the quarter. As the deep shots continue to fall, you can sense the frustration growing among these defenders. Here's Sohan. He's watched by Kuminga. Pass to Champini. Now Wimbanyama. Spurs need to get one up here. Jones from outside. Second shot opportunity. Wimbanyama, no good. The Warriors have gone 6 of 7 and appearing confident in this half. Curry, no good. And Wimbanyama has the ball here for the San Antonio Spurs. Trailing by 17. Jones, the pass to Champagny. Wimbanyama with it. Pass to Vassell. Outside Jones. Wimbanyama screen. From the arc. Jones misses. Golden State has gotten 12 of their points this quarter from deep. Four of six. Thompson outside. Outside Kaminga. Wiggins looking around. That's good from Curry. On the assist by Wiggins. Wiggins has got his fourth assist in this one. Here's Sohan. He's watched by Kaminga. Pass to Wimanyama. Here's the three. Book it again. Seven for 12 and going at the defense. The Warriors have gotten seven of their nine shots to fall. Quality shooting in the second half. Thompson finds Kaminga. Now Green. Wiggins outside. Outside Curry. Curry draws the double. 
Unloads. Again, Golden State. The assist numbers certainly stand out. They've really emphasized ball movement here today. Curry against Jones. Pass to Sohan. Three-pointer. Rebounded by Green. Green's got his seventh rebound here tonight. Now here's Thompson. Outside Kaminga. Here's Green. Wiggins outside. They double-team Curry. And here's Kaminga for three. And it's good. Assisting on the play was Curry. Curry's got his fifth assist in this one. And just executing at a high level. I mean, taking what the defense allows and putting in the work. Basketball IQ is something that gets talked about, but it's importance to a team showing up here, running plays that turn into scores. Now here's Curry from deep three-point range. It's hauled in by Wimbanyama. He's got a nice feel for that crossover, but you still have to finish. Pass to Champagny. And here's Wimbanyama. Counted. Now 8 for 13 with that basket. And the offensive skills of Wimbanyama are a huge part of his high value. And nice to see him delivering. Thompson passes to Kaminga. Here's Green. Outside Curry. And it's going to be a three-second call. And now it's time to look at the players in this rookie class who are shooting the ball the best so far this season. Victor Wimbanyama, third. Thus far, he's been smart offensively, taking only the good looks, and is showing up in his field goal percentage as well. Collins, he's checked in for Victor Wimbanyama. Time called here. San Antonio decides to talk it over. San Antonio has gone just one of six from long distance here in the third. The shots just aren't falling. Vassell against Thompson. Collins outside. Jones. No luck on that one. Curry with some nice D. Just cannot get anything to go. If there's going to be a way to get out of this hole, I don't think he'll be the one to do it. First personal foul. And let's take a moment to First get your take, guys, foul. on the scoring so far for the Warriors. The Their the offensive Warriors. game plan has been simple. Look to shoot it often Two from shots. outside the arc. And the results break, have been outstanding. Break. We want to talk about ball distribution. They've been dominating that aspect of the game. I think there's a bunch of bankers out there. They're dropping dime after dime. And he makes a first. And both free throws good for Green. And so it's Jones who brings up the ball for the Spurs. Collins with a screen on Curry. Jones, the pass to Collins. And he floats it in for the easy two. Credit the sweet setup on that one. Hurting the defense right now is Zach Collins in these pick and roll sets. All right, let's check in with Allie LaForce. You could say the Spurs are in development mode. Devin Vassell said there's a lot of potential, a lot of new opportunity. Just got to make sure we're growing each game and maturing. As long as we play together and we play the right way, we will have a chance to win every game. We've still got the greatest coach of all time sitting back there. Brian. Yeah, you'll get no argument here. Thanks, Allie. Green, the pass to Thompson. On the wing, Curry puts up a three. And again for three. I mean, his flame throwing continues. He's having a season for the ages. 
and he's approaching the fourth most three-point makes in a season. And that mark of 337 set by Steph Curry in 2021. Collins with a screen on Thompson. And it's Vassell penetrating. Collins. And it goes. As the official calls the foul, count it, and he'll shoot one more at the line. A different look for San Antonio. Keldon Johnson, he's checked in for Sohan. Branham comes in for Champagny. And it's Wesley in for Jones. Zach Collins. One shot. And that one misses. So it's the Warriors now. Outside Paul. Switch, 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 switch. Now Looney. Still without a bucket. Thompson shot is off. And the defense got away with one there. I mean, that's the shot he typically makes. The Warriors shooting 56% today. Here's Pajemski. Collins defending. Outside Paul. Thompson with a screen. Six to shoot. Into the lane. Pajemski's shot is good. Pajemski's got five points. Easy look when the defender isn't fighting over the screen. And the coach over there just asking for one simple thing, and that's some effort. He got burned on that one. Now here's Collins. He has six. Vassell passes to Wesley. Collins with a screen on Paul. Oh, a nice shot by Collins. Get an eight. A minute 37 left in the third. Here's Pachemski. Rebounded by Branham. San Antonio has gone just one of six from long distance here in the third. The shots just aren't falling. Here's Wesley. For three. Vassell can't get it to go. Yeah, he's really scrambling to keep them in this game. Gotta respect that hustle. Pass to Pajemski. Collins against Paul. Here's Pajemski. Down low. Here's Saric. And he can't bank that one in. Well, that's a shot they want just about on every possession, if they can get it. He doesn't make them all, but still very much a high percentage look. Here's Wesley. The cell finds Collins. Now here's Johnson. Shot clock at five. And a foul Whoa. called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. It's on Dario Saric. And every year, Johnson seems to get better. His drive to want to be great is admirable. Kelvin Johnson. Two shots. And he knocks down the first one. Wimbanyama's checked in for San Antonio. Graham comes in for Wesley. The Warriors also with a sub. Stephen Curry, he's checked in for Thompson. And Johnson drops them both. 32 seconds left in the third quarter. Paul passes to Curry. From deep. Knocks down the long J. Curry's got 41. I mean, this guy is unreal. What a show. Graham against Paul. Outside Graham. To the middle. Here's Wimbanyama. Not going to go that time. Stephen Curry getting it done for the Warriors. Talk about three shooting. He piled up 18 points from range that quarter. More NBA on 2K Sports right after this.
And it's time to bring up the State Farm assist to the game. And from the two-guard spot, an unselfish play like this sets a fantastic tone. Even though the position is called shooting guard, passing part of your responsibilities in today's game. And we reach the fourth quarter in a game that may already be out of hand. And so in the game for the Warriors. Small lineup with Paul and Curry pairing up in the backcourt. Kevon Looney is out there with Dario Saric. And it's Pajemski in at the three. More and more confidence being shown right now as Zach Collins sinks that shot. Outside Curry. Let's the three fly. San Antonio with a rebound. Wimbanyama's got 13 rebounds in the game. Class eating. Here's Branham. Finds the bottom from 13 feet out. And it's Paul with the ball for the Golden State Warriors. Outside Curry. Launches it. The rebound by the Spurs. Collins has got his seventh rebound here tonight. Fires from 14. And there are the Spurs with another bucket. Ram with a textbook pull up that time. Golden State has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the fourth quarter. Curry finds Paul. Here's Looney. Here's Curry. And that one's on target from the wing. Curry's got 43 points. Getting buckets at a critical time. Just give him the ball and let him go to work. To the wing on the left. Wimbanyama down low. Charge on him. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. Yeah, and the rookie Wimbanyama is just so tough to guard, especially with how good his shot fake is. Antonio Wimbanyama, two shots. And he drops the first. And with the eight-foot wingspan of Wimpyama, it feels like he releases the ball halfway to the bucket. And both free throws good for Wimpyama. The Warriors have gotten just one shot to fall out of three attempts in the fourth. Sharic a screen. And here's Curry for three. The rebound by the Spurs. Outside Grant. Pass to Collins. From the low block. Looney grabs a miss. Looney's got five rebounds in the game. Graham against Paul. Outside Curry. They double-team Curry. Outside Paul. Down to five on the shot clock. And the foul on Chris Paul. That's his first foul of the game. Well, overall, he has played basically flawless basketball, but uh, that was a bad turnover. The Spurs making a switch here. Sohan's checked in. Draymond Green, he's checked in for the Warriors. The Spurs have gone three of four in the fourth and looking confident on offense. Graham, the pass to Branham. Here's Wimbanyama. Looney grabs a miss. Looney's got six rebounds here tonight. And here's Curry for three. No luck on that one. Time for some consideration in the passing category, maybe, Kevin. The shot is just not on. Get somebody else going. Here's Wimbanyama. Got it. Good job in the low post. Wimbanyama's got four points in the quarter. And his fantastic performance from the last game has carried over to tonight. Yeah, and the coach pretty smart for zoning in on him and giving him opportunities to stay with that confident play. And here's Curry for three. Hits the three-pointer. Curry's got 46. He's played a huge role in this game to this point, but it looks like he just wants more. He wants to make sure that this lead holds up. Fires for three. And Johnson gets it to go on the assist from Graham. Oh, so, so solid from deep. Johnson wanting to respond. 
Curry finds Paul. Now Looney. The three from Curry. Good. Another from three. The parade of threes has no end in sight. He just keeps knocking them down. And that latest triple ties him for second for most threes in a game. What a monster performance from deep it's been. And it's a four-way tie now. Himself, Curry, Zach Levine, and Damian Lillard. And he comes up with a bucket. Now what a great option he gives them on every possession. Golden State calls timeout. the sideline. Let's catch up with Allie. I was able to listen in on what Steve Kerr had to say to the team. He said, keep it going, guys. Ride this wave of momentum. We're playing great right now, but we can't let up. Guys, back to you. And Allie, thanks. Connects again from distance. And of course it falls for him. And that three pushing him into the record books. He is now tied for the most threes in a game. An incredible shooting night for him on a night we'll never forget. And all those hot shooting performances from Clay Thompson, this night belongs right there with him. The Warriors have got four of eight shots to drop here in this final quarter. Outside Curry, the three. And again for three. Yeah, he's been hitting threes at a very high level. We haven't seen many better time from deep. That last triple time ties out. him for fourth most made in a season. Yeah, that's his 337th tray of the year, tying him with Steph's 2021 season. Only Curry and Harden have hit more in a single season. Time out called the Spurs. And the Spurs with some changes. Champini, he's checked in for Johnson. Cell comes in for Branham, and it's Jones in for Graham. Jones over to the wing here's Wimbanyama up and in on the layup Wimbanyama's got 27 points <laughs> there were questions about Wimbanyama's strength coming into the league no problem with the contact here Kaminga with a screen on Vassell inside Rejected by Wimbanyama. Sohan, the pass to Jones. Outside Wimbanyama. Vassell outside. Six on the shot clock. Puts it up from 12. Rebounded by Green. Well, he finds some space in that in-between gap there. Too bad he can't release that one on target. This has been their game plan here in the final period. We'll see if it continues to work out. It's one thing to have teams shoot a bunch of threes, but with this team being that hot defensively, you got to chase them away from anywhere near that line. Now here's Vassell to the wing, right side. Wimbanyama down low, green covering, and Wimbanyama gets it to go. This is a one-man show right now. He's on a mission to get him out of this hole. Thompson against Vassell. Outside Curry. Puts up a deep three. Rebound San Antonio. Wimbanyama's got 15 rebounds here tonight. Jones against Curry. Jones, the pass to Vassell. Pass to Wimbanyama. Outside Jones. Shoots over Curry. And there's another one for the Spurs. And so it's Curry with it. He brings it up for the Golden State Warriors. Outside, Green. Kaminga down low. Rebounded by the Spurs. Sohan's got five rebounds in the game. Vassell outside. 
Pass to Sohan. To the inside. Wimbanyama. Oh! Wimbanyama throws it down. And Wimbanyama can dunk it basically just standing up. you got to keep him out of the paint. Outside Curry. Out left to the wing. Here's Kuminga. And it's good. Just Assisting on the Kuminga. play was Curry. Curry's got six assists now in the game. They haven't relied on him as much as usual, but when his number has been called, he shot well enough to help them earn the lead. Now here's Jones to the paint. Oh, got a piece of it. And stolen by Green. In transition, here come the Warriors. Wiggins from long range. Buries it from three. And the Warriors lead by 18. Hard to win games when you allow clean looks from the perimeter. Left side, Jones. Sohan, the pass to Wembanyama. Here's Sohan. Fires the three. Rebounded by Green. Green's got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. Wiggins passes to Curry. Back to Wiggins. There's the triple. And the Warriors with another three. San Antonio has gone two of three from beyond the arc here in the fourth. Jones against Curry. Jones, the pass to Wembanyama. Vassell outside. Shot clock at five. They need this. Wembanyama finds Jones. With one on the clock. Wembanyama, no good. And for the Warriors, they're shooting 56% today. Curry against Jones. Pass to Green. Kaminga with it. Curry passes to Kaminga. Fires the three. Jones grabs the board. Around the league, we're increasingly seeing former players in front office positions, Grant. It's so true, B.A., and we need even more former players in those roles. They bring a perspective that a lot of front offices just don't have. They can add value with their experience. I really like this move. Green, third personal foul. Second team foul. At the line for San Antonio, Trey Jones. One shot. And the Warriors shooting around 53% in the fourth. Outside, Green. Pass to Thompson. They double-team Thompson. Wiggins from long range. It's hauled in by Wimbanyama. Ooh, he missed an easy chance to put some points on the board. He won't get a much better look at that kind of shot again here probably tonight. Warriors with the rebound. Outside Curry. Kaminga with a screen on Jones. And here's Curry for three. Rebounded by Champagny. Champagny's got four rebounds now. Jones with the ball. Wimbanyama, screen on Kaminga. Steps back. Jones, the pass to Wimbanyama. And he banks in the layup. Wimbanyama's got 33 points. And they were really able to find the mismatches they wanted and exploit those all night. Great execution from the players and coaching staff for the Warriors. One area where they set themselves apart today, their aggressiveness in getting steals. But it really hindered their opponent all game long. And of course, it helped spark their own offense. And tonight's win will give them an even 40 on the year. And as it was happening, as it was building, you knew this was a monster game for Stephen Curry. It looked like a couple times they might be wearing him down, but not the case. At the offensive end, he was just devastating. Four on the clock. And count it. The shot is good, and he'll go to the line. They really came in with the right mindset today. I can guarantee you their flight home will be filled with some smiles. Yeah, when you step into an opposing team's arena and you can play with this type of composure, 
Boy, that food tastes good on the way out of town. A line change here for San Antonio. Mind the lanes. Mind the lanes. One shot. Clay Thompson, really one of the more pretty jump shots in the NBA. I hope kids are watching. No wasted motion, incredible efficiency, and the mechanics really do set the gold standard. Now here's Graham, and here's Collins for three. Can't hit that one. Johnson against Thompson. Pass to Looney. Back to Thompson. Here's Jackson Davis. Back to Thompson. Outside Paul. Takes a three. Rebounded by Branham. Now Graham. Collins with a screen on Paul. Pass to Collins. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. There's just so much activity from John Collins. He's a stretch five at times, hard to track around the floor. For San Antonio, Zach Collins. Two shots. Free throw is good from Collins. And both free throws good for Collins. And so Golden State takes this one. And by a big margin, it ends up being a fairly easy road win. Those are so hard to come by. It's never easy to take a game in someone else's building. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. So alongside Grant Hill, Allie LaForce, Brent Barry, and our entire 2K crew, I'm Brian Anderson saying thank you for watching. Now it's time for the New Balance Player of the Game, Stephen Curry.